right, all right, seniors. Um, can each of y'all talk about your senior season so far? You know what you think of it. Um, you know personally and collectively as a team. You know, like maybe some of the games or you know any of the ups and downs that y'all have gone through so far. For me, the senior season has been um, fun, and um, I think that we we've grown as a team, especially going through the whole season. Um, we've won um, a lot of big games, and we've worked hard this year to get to where we are. So I would say that for me, my senior year has been exactly what I I hope it would be. Like I, mm -hmm. I'm glad that we're going. I'm glad that when I leave here, I can say we accomplished something. Yeah. What are your goals as the season winding down? SEC, making the NCAA tournament, all that kind of stuff? Well, I mean, of course that has to be a goal, especially if you're in the SEC, especially because so many teams are competitive in the SEC. But our main goal is, is to win an SEC championship right now. Like, we have to take it a game at a, at a time. Mm -hmm. um, I have to, you know, agree with Shay on that, you know. Um, one of my, my biggest goals for – being here at Florida was to win the SEC championship and show up in the NCAA A's, you know, because we it's always been a point where we got there but didn't make it. And, you know, I feel like our senior year is, is going good because, you know, we're headed in the right direction, you know, at the right time. And we did took some beats, but, you know, it's also it's, it's our time now, so it's, it's going pretty good for us. All right. When the season started, we came around and asked everybody, you know, What's, what are you looking forward to this year, senior year? Right, 24 games in, 22 and two. Did y'all imagine that? What kind of moments have y'all shared going through these first 24 games and this record start? What are you gonna take with you after y'all graduate? I mean, well, I hope it wasn't for nothing. During the summer, I was pushing sleds and <laughs> <laughs> having to run with uh, one another on each other's back. I mean, I, I would hope that all that hard work wasn't for nothing. Really? So. I would say we're, we're at what we should be because we worked really, really hard this summer, like too hard this summer, working on our game, just working on being stronger, working on everything. So for us to be, um, for us to be ranked number nine, it's, we, we really worked for it. Yeah, we did, man. Totally. I mean, we deserve, you know, to be in the top ten with any team in the nation because we work so hard each and every day. Um, we also, this summer, we, we all got together and said how we want this season to go and how we was going to go about doing it. And I, just like you said, we have a great conditioning coach, Karen, you know what I'm saying? She's making sure we're, we're tight, fit, you know, in shape, everything. And, you know, in, in many of those games, we, you can tell, you know, we're, we're still going while the other teams are tired. And then you know it, everything that we spoke of before the season, we're walking on. We're, we're walking the walk that we talked. So, you know, we're working real hard, and we're gonna continue to work hard and get better. So the high odds be greater than they, they were before. It must be pretty satisfying to see all the hard work <coughs> coming in and paying off. Yep. Talk about beating. Y'all beat Tennessee your freshman year, and they got some beatings from them. I think like past. Or some of the times are all like 20 plus points, but now you just beat them. You know, as Coach Butler said, not win, but beat them. What does that mean to y'all as seniors? Oh, for me, for, I'm, I'm from Tennessee, so to beat Tennessee to me was, was a great win. I mean, not saying all the other wins wasn't great, but just showing people back at home from Tennessee that you don't have to be an All American or whatnot to, to be able to play on in Tennessee or even be a Tennessee team. Like you can just be in, from a small town and still do do well in high school and still be a team like Tennessee. So for me, it meant a lot to beat Tennessee because they're so competitive and who don't want to beat Tennessee? I mean, they're they're like, they have the number one for, program in, in, at their school and like Pat Simon is a, is a great coach and she has great players on her team. So for me, it, it meant a lot. Um, it meant a lot for me too, because I'm also from Tennessee and you know, we beat them twice in, in our in our Florida career. It's it's a great accomplishment because how often do a great coach get beat? You know what I'm saying? So it's it's a good accomplishment for for us as a team and myself. And then my mom was there to wit to witness both uh, times we had beaten them, my freshman year and then my senior year. So it's all good.
Meek? Um, yeah. I totally agree with what Kim and Shay was just saying. I mean, they're a good team. And Pat Summit, she's a great coach. So, hey, who wouldn't beat Pat Summit? I mean, everybody want to beat her. Yeah. Marge? Yeah, I agree with him too. I mean, working because y'all have five games left in the SEC, tied for first. <laughs> so that title that y'all are aiming for is right there. What can y'all take from this win, moving on to Vandy and LSU and everything? Um, well, I could say, you know, just keep going forward. You know, we we have we have beat a lot of teams, but also we can't we can't get relaxed because a lot of teams are are out to beat us. And you know, it finish finish the SCC up. You know, do as well as we can. You know, so we can have you know good standards and be able to move forward with our other dreams and goals that we want to do. Yeah, and from also from from the wins that that we do, um, and that we are able to to come out on top with, um, we still have a lot to learn from. Like from the Tennessee game, we didn't rebound very well, and um, we still have to go to practice and and work on things. Like our wins are not perfect. We're not gonna go through a whole game without making mistakes. There's always something that we can improve on. And so that's what we do. We look at the film after um, a win or after a loss and we figure out where we can improve in. And so that that's what keeps us going also. Mm -hmm. What are you looking forward to the most in your last uh, five games heading into the postseason play? Win. Yeah, <laughs> winning. Just what continue on the win. win. Just, Just keep working together as a team yeah. and executing we have to execute in the game and stuff like that. Growing stronger. Yeah. Um, Cause Team. I mean, once we work together as one, I mean, we're unstoppable. We're unstoppable. Yeah. yeah. Good mentality to have. Unstoppable. All right. Well, that's it. And if y'all have anything else y'all want to add. No. All right. Go Gators. <laughs>